morning everybody, it's Nicole. Uh, it's early Saturday morning and I'm about to make uh, my pre-workout shake. Um, we are making a clean high protein milkshake. And not only is it high protein and really good for you, but it tastes really good. And I'll show you ways to add some more flavor to it so that it really does feel like you're drinking a milkshake. This is Kaizen Whey Isolate Protein. We got it from Costco, it's two kilograms, so it's just under five pounds. It's about 50 bucks, and it's 35 grams of protein per scoop. It is really good protein. It's, it's really high in protein. It's pure whey, whey isolate protein. It is awesome for adding in baking, in smoothies, in the milkshake that I'm gonna make. I love this protein. This one, this flavor is vanilla ice cream. There's also a chocolate, but we haven't tried it because we really like the vanilla. So I have my magic bullet and I'm just going to add a cup. To start, I'm going to add a cup of unsweetened creamy cashew milk. You can use almond milk, but I, we find that the cashew milk is a lot thicker and it makes um, for a creamier shape. So shake it up and add one cup of cashew milk. Oops, I spilled. <laughs> Sorry. Then a scoop of your protein. A level a level scoop. Like that. Then you're gonna want to put some stevia. I use a heaping quarter teaspoon, so like that. Now you can just use chocolate protein powder if you want, but like I said, we really like the vanilla, so we add cocoa powder. I'm gonna add a teaspoon of cocoa powder. This one is go gourmet baking cocoa. It's Dutch dark cocoa, and we get this at Costco. You get this huge container for $6, and it lasts forever. And I'm gonna put just like a heaping teaspoon of cocoa powder in there, and then, if you want to add more flavoring and make it like a chocolate mint, you can add an eighth teaspoon of peppermint extract. You can also make like a chocolate peanut butter shake and put about a tablespoon of peanut butter in there. But I use peanut butter later in the day, so I'm just gonna leave it plain. And then put about, depending on the size of your cup, four to six ice cubes. I'm gonna put five in mine and I'm just gonna blend it off camera because it's really loud and then I'll come back and show you what it looks like okay so this is what it looks like I'll blend it up uh, blend it to whatever you whatever consistency you like I do mine until the ice cubes are completely blended and that is what it looks like and you can add more ice cubes if you want but um, my cup is small so I put five and that seems to be the perfect amount and now you have your high protein milkshake. 35 grams of protein in here and a really good chocolatey taste. Mm, you would never know that there's protein powder in this. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'm gonna enjoy my protein shake and then go work out. And thank you for watching. And don't forget to like and subscribe and we'll see you guys next time. Bye guys.